Like sponsors, they handle it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Welcome to Lee Pitts Live After Work. Uh, of course, I'm Lee Pitts, and uh, let's brand that in your head. Lee Pitts Live After Work. What is it? It's an event where we come out and socialize in the urban community. We're not apologizing for that. We're drawing people from specifically around here in Southwest Florida who come out and listen to some grown folk music, some live entertainment, uh, free food, free pictures, and all that happens as a result of these sponsors like this, the Esmond Lewis Law Firm and the North Law Firm. I went out, contacted my buddies and said, look, let's do something nice in the community. And the beautiful thing about it is no hesitation. Everybody was in for it and we're starting something that's going to eventually you'll see us having to go to uh, like a hotel or something like that to hold the crowd as it continues to get up. Can't have that music piping in here. So let's get a chance to meet some of uh, uh, the sponsors here tonight, and they've already got a chance to partake in some stuff. Let's start off with you, Esmond. You haven't been on the show in a minute. Esmond Lewis, uh, first of all, thank you for being a sponsor of this event. Uh, Lee, thank you for having me. It was my pleasure to participate in this. Anytime you call and it's for the community, I'm here. You guys might know I didn't tell anybody else who was sponsored. I, I got too many lawyers. I just, well, I see all y'all cool, but I, uh, I just... Put it together, then all of a sudden you start seeing, oh, he's involved, she's involved. But uh, as soon as I call Ezra, I say, hey man, I'm ready to roll on this. And uh, all the photos that you'll see on social media and all over the place, you'll see the Ezra Lewis Law Firm logo on there, all photos sponsored by Ezra Lewis. And over here, of course, is my longtime friend, Joe North, a pillar in the community as well. Joe, great to get you out here as a sponsor of the uh, Red Carpet Interviews, my friend. Well, thank you, and thank you for having the foresight to put this together. I think this is going to be the beginning of many, many more activities like this, and it's bringing the community together. I appreciate and it. And what I'm so surprised at is just a little bit after 7 o'clock, and people are already here. we got the 8 o'clock crowd going to be coming in. It goes on until 11 o'clock, but the goal is to get people in here right a little bit after work and relax, have a little drink, have a little fun, mingle, and listen to some nice music. Have you got a chance to hear the music in there yet? Yeah, well, the music, uh, the, li the live music has not come on, but I understand that the band is uh, about to set up, so we should be hearing some live music pretty soon, but the atmosphere is great. It it's so wonderful to see a professional crowd. Uh, you know, people that look like you, everybody's dressed up, smelling right. nice, looking great, and it's just a wonderful event. I, I like, like Joe, I, I echo his statements. I hope that this is something that we will do on a much more regular basis. That's right. We'll, we'll work that out. And so the key is for our generation, this new generation, we're the new, the new black generation in Southwest Florida. We, we have come up and now we're here and we're doing things. And we're going to take our uh, knowledge and expertise and our relationships in the community. We're going to be providing you guys with things that you can come out on a nice occasion like this, dress nice and enjoy each other. Now, Joe, the, um, we move around uh, and, and right after work on a Friday and things like this, we don't really have anything to do. This is, this is a whole different flavor, right? That's right. We've got something to do now <laughs> and moving forward. And what's good about it is we come out and we're meeting new friends as well as mingling with some of our old friends. And then 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, on up, everybody's out here. It's really a great affair. Okay. Let's learn a little bit about your firm. Uh, the, the North Law Firm, what type of uh, business do you practice there? What kind of uh, law do you practice there? I handle all types of injury cases, the car accident cases as well as the negligent security cases. Okay, so call Joe. And what type of uh, practice do you practice, Esmond? Well, we have a general civil practice, Lee, so we do uh, general business, uh, litigation, so it uh, matters that are in court. Um, of, of a wide variety of topics. I don't do personal injury, so Joe and I rarely ever see each other in terms of uh, courtroom work, um, uh, general business and uh, civil matters, uh, business to business, person to business. You've got something like that where somebody took something from you, a contract dispute, I'm the guy to call. But wouldn't it be good to have a mega firm with a one-stop shop? We service all, wouldn't that be something? <laughs> Y'all yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> have been saying that for the longest uh, longest bit, but that is something that would definitely... We might uh, make it happen. Yeah. Let's Wakanda make it happen. forever. Let's <laughs> Wakanda forever. Like, let me check this out, Lila. Uh One thing I want to uh, share with my two buddies here, what you're going to start seeing tonight is a lot. If you look over there, you start seeing all these faces we don't recognize. And the reason we don't recognize them is because with the television show, 
we are reaching like seven counties and we're drawing people in when we announce it on TV that right. we've never seen before. So all you people up in Sarasota, Charlotte County, Collier County, Lee County, Henry County, Glaze, who watch Lee Biz Live, we're glad you're coming out and supporting and make sure you come to the next one. The uh, Let's give you a website. www.thenorthlawfirm.com Mine is a little bit more complicated, <laughs> but it's www dot esmond lewis law dot com and that's spelled e s m o n d l e w i s l a w dot com and now one of the things you guys are part of the judge anderson uh group or something judge tell us about that what is that it's the isaac anderson jr bar association and it is a branch of the national bar association which is also through florida the virgil hawkins bar association it's the oldest black bar and the only national black bar and we're a local chapter of that organization i'll, I'll leave it to joe to to talk about the namesake for the organization Go ahead, Joy. Well, Isaac Anderson was not just the first black lawyer here in Lee County, but also the first black judge here in Lee County. So it was all too appropriate to have the association named after him. So y'all keeping that legacy going, and you guys meet from time to time, or you just like what, what are some things y'all doing in the community? Scholarship, encourage people to get into law. What are some things y'all doing? Well, both of those, and then every year at Thanksgiving, the association hands out. Thanksgiving dinners to needy families and then we do something at Christmas time as well and then throughout the course of the year we put on legal clinics. Okay, so people are looking at this uh, streaming live uh, on social media on television and, hear and hearing us on radio you may not realize it, but we got a nice compliment of minority uh, Hispanic and African American lawyers in our community that are doing a yeoman's job in their legal practices. Do people get surprised? Do you ever get surprised when people realize we got black lawyers around here? That That's correct. I, I think most people are of the mind that there may be only a handful of black lawyers. We are at this point probably over 40 black attorneys in just this area The Southwest Florida area, yeah. yeah. Did y'all heard that? 40. <laughs> Man, I, and, I, and I do this TV show, and I thought I knew something. I didn't know it was 40. Somebody asked me off the top of your head, Lee, I would say, ah, uh, eight, you know. <laughs> well, that's outstanding. Well, gentlemen, uh, we're glad that you're, you're, you're supporting us, and more uh, glad that you guys have been great role models in the community, uplifting uh, positive images. When you go inside, be sure to take a look at that flat screen TV. You'll see your logos and everything flashing, and mingle with the people, okay? Will do. We'll be right back with more Lee Piss Live after work. We're downtown at Club Celsius, and the crowd is filing in, and uh, they're hanging outside so much because it's just networking. We'll be right back. Good job. Great interview, man.